In this video, we're going to talk about Uber Green. That's what I said yesterday. What's Uber Green? Well, in this video, I'm going to share with you exactly what is Uber Green and whether it's good for drivers and is it good for the environment. And stick around because at the end of the video, I'm going to share with you how much extra money drivers can make if they have a hybrid car or if they have an electric vehicle, an EV. All right, so stick around. Hey everybody, it is Jay Crater with The Rideshare Guy, 7 a.m. on Wednesday morning. Yes, there is Nespresso in there. <laughs> A lot of times viewers uh, try and uh, tell me that there's no espresso in my cup. And I guarantee you, I am needing espresso right now. All right, let's jump into this. Uh, so yesterday I was asked to uh, review uh, the Uber Green and, um, and then share with you what I discovered. So let's jump right into it. So number one, what's Uber Green? Well, it's a new way for hybrid owners, like I have a Honda Accord hybrid, right? I used to drive a, a Prius, that's a hybrid, or an electric vehicle, right? Like a Tesla, right? A Tesla would be 100% electric. You don't put any gas in the machine. So this is a new way for drivers to earn some extra money. So let's go right to the horse's mouth and see what Uber said about Uber Green. Drivers who choose to drive greener and electric vehicles will earn extra money with each trip. In the US and Canada, hybrid and EV drivers will receive an extra 50 cents directly from the rider on every Uber Green trip completed. Since our goal is to ultimately transition all drivers to zero emission vehicles, drivers using a zero emission vehicle, namely a battery EV, electric vehicle, will receive an additional $1 for every trip they complete in the USA and Canada. This means that battery EV drivers will receive both incentives, a total of $1.50 extra for every Uber Green trip they complete. Okay, so that's what it is. It's a way to earn extra money on every trip that you take if you have a hybrid or an electric vehicle. Number two, where is Uber Green at this point? So we see here, Chicago is where, this is where Uber Green will be available soon. Chicago, Denver, Los Angeles, San Francisco, includes San Jose, Santa Barbara, Orange County, that's down in LA, San Diego, Seattle, Portland, Oregon, Eugene, Oregon, Ottawa, okay, with the Waterloo region of Canada, Vancouver, Toronto, and Madison, Wisconsin, okay? So that's where uh, it is or going to be soon. Number three, there are a few more things about Uber Green to share. So this is more news about Uber Green. First, Uber Green will be available in over 65 cities internationally. All right, so this is expanding out. Riders will be incentivized to choose these green rides over traditional rides. The way they're doing that, Uber will reward them with three X points. So three times the points for every trip taken compared to 2x points for a typical Uber X ride. So this is how they're incenting the, the uh, passengers to select a green ride. Number four, let's do the math. Let's do the math. All right. So let's say you're driving a Tesla. Okay. Um, that would be the electric vehicle. Or you could be driving my uh, Honda Accord hybrid. Let's say you drive six days a week and you get 20 rides per day, okay? So that's a low estimate. Um, we don't know, but what we don't know is what percentage of your rides will be green rides, right? How will the passengers embrace this, all right? So this is, uh, this is, the, this is what's possible if you get the maximum uh, number of rides. So um, that would be $60 per week, right? You could make $10 per day. This would be just driving a, a hybrid car. That would be 3,000 per year. Uh, that would be over 50 weeks. And if you drove an EV, that would be 9,000 for the EV. So I thought, wow, that's a lot of money, right? So I submitted it to my editors and I said, is my math correct? And my math was not correct. So what you're seeing now is, uh, 
uh, Uber tamping down on what's possible. So it says, by signing up for the incentive, drivers with battery EVs can make an extra $1 on every Uber trip up to $4,000 annually until September 30th, okay, for in a year. Terms and conditions apply. So that means it's, it's capped at 4,000 trips, all right? So 4,000 trips times $1 is $4,000. So that's, that's what they set up there. But remember, you're also getting the extra 50 cents. Even if you have an EV, you still get the hybrid money. So that would be another $2,000. So you see in the bottom red circle, uh, the bottom red ellipse, um, total possible would be 6,000 for the EV and 2,000 for the hybrid. So just to put that in perspective, if you're a driver and you're making 50,000 in a year and you can make an extra six, that's a 12% increase if you're driving a 100% electric vehicle. And if you're driving a hybrid, that would be a 4% bump. That's if you're making 50,000 in a year, kind of working this more full time. Um, so uh, it, it really makes an argument for getting an EV, you know, uh, because you're getting all that extra money uh, to support you in the process. Something to think about. So what are the key takeaways here? Well, this is all part of Uber's big plan to be 100% uh, emission free by the year 2040. Okay, so that's in uh, 20 years. So uh, their, their uh, bigger, bigger goal, right? 100% emissions free by 2040. How, how are they gonna do that? by expanding Uber Green to make it easier for riders to choose to travel in hybrids or EVs, committing 800 million in resources to help hundreds of thousands of drivers transition to EVs by 2025. That's only five years away. That's actually less than five years away. Investing in our multimodal network to promote sustainable alternatives to personal cars, and then being transparent and accountable to the public along the way. So my key takeaway is good stuff. Good for the driver, driver can make some extra money, right? I've got a hybrid. If I were driving, I'd be getting a little bit of extra money. That's always a good thing. We like that. Um, good for the environment, right? Less, uh, less gas uh, emissions going out in, into the environment and uh, polluting our air. So that's a good thing. So overall, I gotta say, good, good. Let's, let's do this, you know? I hope, I hope Uber and Lyft can achieve their goals. So that's the bottom line on Uber Green. Now you know what I know about Uber Green. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. That would be great. Thank you for watching. When you give it a thumbs up, that allows more people to see it, you know, the way the algorithm works. So give it the thumbs up. Thank you for watching. If you have not subscribed yet to our YouTube channel, subscribe. We put out like five, six videos every single week all about the industry and about the gig economy and personal finance and all kinds of great stuff and uh, you'll be notified next time we do a youtube live we just did one yesterday harry the rideshare guy campbell uh, was live on youtube and if you signed up uh, for notifications you were notified and you might have been there live to see it all right you go ahead and have a great day this is jay crater saying be safe out there wear a mask keep yourself healthy and those that you love healthy Bye for now.